what you need to become a content creator. So the first thing you might need as a content creator is equipment. You need something to film with, you need audio, and you might need some lights. There's also other things that can come in handy, just like a tripod, lens filters, etc. To be a creator, you can have a camera with lenses. A lot of people are using their phone nowadays, which is also a really good option. But despite what you have, just use any equipment that you have to your advantage. A lot of people before starting content might think they need the best equipment to become a great content creator but that's not generally the case because the equipment doesn't make the person but it's what the person does with the equipment that makes it. The second thing you need to become a content creator you're going to need a strategy. If you generally want your platform to work like a business, you're gonna have to approach it like one. You need to, in a sense, know what you're doing. At least be prepared and understand to know what can come from what you do, you know what I'm saying? Just depending on how you approach your business, can make or break it, just like a YouTube channel. So the third thing you need to become a content creator. After having a plan and knowing what you're doing, now you need to start showing up and showing face. When it comes to starting from scratch, the first hurdle is just getting your face out there most of the time. A lot of people still struggle to put themselves out there, but you gotta understand that without the confidence to do what you're doing, people aren't gonna want to invest in your platform. So the third thing you need essentially to become a content creator is the confidence to show face. So the fourth thing you need to become a content creator is patience. A lot of people feel like they need to grind hard as fast as they can to blow up overnight. But understand this isn't a race. Maybe you didn't blow up within a couple months, maybe even a couple years. But at least if you're working hard, accumulating progress throughout those years, you will nine times out of 10 lead yourself somewhere in the end if you keep on going on with it. As relatively easy as it seems, people don't understand how hard it is to really be a threshold in content creation nowadays you know you really need to just sit back do your due diligence and wait for your time to shine so the fifth thing you need to become a content creator you need to understand that there needs to be always a balance on catering to the audience and catering to yourself it will 100 percent always be good to give back to your audience because it'll be your audience that will essentially grow your platform. So at the end of the day, you need to always think about the audience and what you are providing for them. But at the same time, you need to balance out what you want to get out of it. Because thinking about what the audience needs will sometimes leave you in a place of feeling not fulfilled. At the end of the day, it's your business and you got to do what you want to do despite what anyone says whether it's your audience or not so you really need to double down on how you feel and not let it get persuaded but understand you gotta give back to the audience and keep them in mind with what you provide so i would say those are like the five things you need to become a content creator don't be the person to consume know these advice and not apply it to life so i feel like making this video just to essentially give out my tips and understanding for people that want to start becoming a content creator nowadays. So you guys already know what it be. You guys know it's the guy that's me. Thank you for tuning in. And to anyone wishing to start content, good luck. Good luck, man. Let's get it.